how ready are you for tomorrow is what i want to talk about those of you that i post finance and accounting videos you consume it which is good but you know what how ready are you for tomorrow if you have somebody like me and by the grace of god what i've been able to do lay my hands on and accomplish in the field of finance and accounting telling you this what majority will not actually tell you how ready are you for tomorrow especially those of you that are just beginning your career now it's been a while for me now over two decades right in the field of finance and accounting and almost done it all hmm? so how ready are you the truth is accounting is going to remain forget those that will tell you that accounting is gone no accounting is going to remain just like uh, joshua the famous bo boxer said that he's going to and he's going to try as much as possible or he, he wish that his child will become an accountant that tells you a lot and majority of good big entrepreneurs and shakers and movers of industry will tell you that accounting and finance is very important now as important as they are they are changing or as important as the industry is things are changing not the way we met it we are leaving it for you i'm not going anywhere anymore my name is Atta, okay but things have changed now how ready are you in form of taking on the challenge of the industry why you consume the critical core competencies you must be ready equally to ensure you engage in the reality of your world right about now right and what is the reality of our world is no longer monotonous many accountants and even research have established it they used to call us that we can engage more meaningfully about any other topic or topics apart from our own core competence outside the field of accounting. Uh, this should not be so. For you preparing for the future, you must be robust in your outlook and you must be agile. What does it mean to be agile? You must be flexible and ready to, to scale, ready to move into things while you maintain your core competence. Let me give you an example. A ship on the ocean. A ship on the ocean. You are like a ship on the ocean. The ocean is the business world right now. And while the ship must remain strong and stable, it must be flexible enough to adapt to the changing direction of the wind and even the whirlwind. It looks outside is not stable because it moves up and, and goes down and the like. But the real core competence of finance and accounting will remain the same. Without it, no organization can survive. That is the truth. But the dictate of the environment will only allow the ship to navigate if the ship remains flexible to hit. If the ship which you are now not is not ready to adapt to the flexibility of the changing environment that ship will not sell through 
and I know you want to sell through. My efforts is that you sell through. And that is why I'm telling you this. Your outlook must change. Study wild. Read wild. Be diversified. The field of finance and accounting is a whole world of yourself. Look into as much as possible areas that you can adapt to. That is how to survive in this new dispensation. Do you want to know more about what you can do or maybe counsel, advice and the like? We all need mentor. You may not realize it. Don't let it be too late. I'm not, I don't even have that time to be your mentor other than this I'm doing. But if you are really ready to take on your future in the field of finance and accounting, you can reach out to me and let's see how we can work things out. You, I don't need to tell you, you know the love I have for, for you, the field of finance and accounting, and to see everyone thrive in it. But nevertheless, unless we change, because many times when I shoot a video that is not finance and accounting topic, many of us, we don't watch it, right? The, the world has changed. The world has changed and I always will bring you what I know you need. Anyway, in, the, in this world, in this business world, they say you should sell what people want, what they need. Maybe that's the reason. But because I love you, I'm doing it. GJ Associates, my name is Benga Olatunji FCA. We are valued to life. We are valued to your businesses. Just as you can see that my children are around and you could see how busy I could be. But nevertheless, we juggle it all and God has granted us success. Bye for now.